Hi, I'm Margie Fink with Transfiguring Adoption with another Foster Care and Adoption book review for the grown-ups, the Kid-Friendly ADHD and Autism Cookbook, the ultimate guide to the gluten-free, casein-free diet, what it is, why it works, how to do it. It's by Pamela Compart and Dana, Dana Lakey. As you can see, it's been well used, it's filthy. Um, I'll read to you from the back. Simple, delicious, and fun recipes that battle symptoms related to ADHD and autism. This special diet has become an essential step of treatment for families struggling with autism and ADHD. And these recipes for gluten and casein-free foods, meals, and snacks are simple to prepare and yummy, making it easier than ever to please kids who have behavioral or developmental challenges or are just picky eaters. In this revised and updated edition, We've compiled all the latest research findings and added more information on other food culprits. We've also added 100 new recipes. So in addition to all of the great recipes you discovered in the first edition, list some different recipes, you'll find brand new recipes destined to become family favorites. The kid-friendly ADHD and autism cookbook tackles all of your concerns and serves as a how-to guide for beginning and maintaining a healthier diet that can improve your child's brain function. You will learn how food sensitivities differ from food allergies, how to avoid unsuspected sources of gluten, casein, soy, corn, and nuts, ways to disguise healthy foods and get rid of junk food, what to do about the very picky eater, many substitutes, substitutes, and more substitutes. If you've ever thought that providing your kids with nutritious and delicious gluten and casein-free meals is too much for you to handle, it isn't. It's easier than you think, and it can actually be made to be fun for you and your child. This book shows you how. This is a book that I have recommended over and over and over again for families. It, like it said, it breaks down the science. It tells you kind of why some of these foods can create different behavioral um, impacts, um, but in a very parent-friendly way. Um, just gives you all kinds of information. Each recipe shows you different, um, like egg is in this one. It, it's not crossed out. So you can go through and you can find ones that um, are for, specifically designed for your child's food sensitivities. Um, talks, it's just so full of information. Um, absolutely a fabulous book. Like it said, lots of substitutes. Um, and our kids, we've got four kids and um, they can be picky at times. And I don't think there's been a single recipe in this book that our family has not enjoyed. There's some that maybe weren't favorites, but for the majority of them, they absolutely love them. There are recipes that they ask for over and over again. They're healthy, um, just really, really great. I, we've got a birthday coming up next week, and um, all the recipes that were requested for that birthday dinner are in this book. So it stays on our um, counter pretty much all the time. Um, just an absolutely great book. And it's something that's good for foster families, adoptive families, and kiddos with special needs. Um, there's been a lot of just different research on the impacts of nutritional interventions and this is a great way to do that. I hope this has helped to nurture and grow your foster or adoptive family.